I think the new classrooms are basically just amazing. It makes me, it makes me happy. Yeah, it's just like, it's nice to have a new classroom. A lot more space and the view as well. It's just generally nicer because it feels brand new. At Cat and Grove School, um, it's a six class extension. Uh, several other extensions, a store extension, uh, extension to the nursery and then extension to the headmaster's office, main office and the toilet block out the back. Any building works that are undertaken in the school environment um, come with significant challenges. Um, our responsibility is to the 650 plus kids that we've got in the school um, and to the staff. And we have to make sure that whatever is happening in and around the school doesn't impact on that and that requires the people with whom we are working to be both sensitive to our needs and for us to be at least aware of um, your needs as a, as, a, as a company. We've been involved in building projects in and around the school for the last nearly 14 years and I think from, from my experience, um, Morgan Sindel have done an extremely good job in making sure that that relationship is as, was as productive as it possibly could be. While we're working in the school, we need to let uh, the public, the children and the teachers as well uh, know how important safety is as well. We've done a safety poster competition to coincide with the school assemblies. Uh, our then our safety team, our SHE advisor, helped to judge that competition, got the kids involved of all the school, all the years. There was um, three winners. Uh, they then helped to paint a big sheet of ply, uh, decorate all that up so we could put it at the front of the school at the main gates. We had uh, photographs with the children, the winners. Uh, they got to dress up in the PPE again and let them explain what they were drawing, what they were painting, to let them know or so they could explain to us what they thought site safety was. I drawed the school and um, a person. I drew a digger and uh, and I wrote there that uh, it's dangerous to go near diggers and on the side. The person who is the site manager on a project such as this becomes critically important and Justin from our point of view has done a, a really or did a really superb job in that respect. Um, he was never somebody that we didn't feel we could approach. We could approach him at any time over any issue. He always gave us the time and bent over backwards to make sure that um, whatever whatever we asked of him he he was able to deliver but in terms of his capacity to alter the work schedule to suit suit our demands I think he did a remarkable job. Morgan Sindel we tried to go that extra mile at the end for handover make handover special it is our lasting legacy on any contract but uh, with Cat and Grove we uh, well, it's more of a pleasure really well, we had lots of photos, and there was this like big net holding loads of balloons up, and then they peeled the string down, and loads of balloons came falling on us. Yeah, and on the cake there was like um, I don't know what they're called, but um, he lit he lit them, and they all went into flames. And they were, they were like fun. sparklers. Yeah, sparklers. Yeah. And they had our thing. school logo. It had our school logo on it, and Morgan said on the side. It was quite fun because um, we ate cake. <laughs> you know, I don't think we could have asked for a better bunch of people. Um, we have an expression here um, that is about people being cat and gravers, and the people who, from Morgan Sindel who were on site were certainly people that we would be happy to call cat and gravers.